How about they're ignoring Jeff and just focusing on me? Time to hang up the web. Crazy. This keeps up. Bystanders will get shot. I gotta get in close. Hey guys, room for one more? Long time no see. Here's your stuff. Decides to run on time. That was close. Oh, ho, 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 that was close. Cool. Jeff, you came in clutch. He's like Jeff, everybody. <laughs> We've now identified the officer as Jefferson Davis. We're being told he has minor injuries and is expected to make a full recovery. Excuse me, miss. Are you supposed to be here? More than you. After that auction house thing, the bugle put me on the city beat, which means I get to focus full time on real stories like this and the demons. You know the closer you get to them, the more you become a target, right? The closer I get, the better chance we have to stop them. We? Officer Davis, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. No comment. I don't blame you. But these guys are going to tell their story with or without you. And they thrive on controversy. So what's your end? I don't have one. I just listen. Okay. Up in. She's good. <laughs> She put her right into his palm. Man, I'm beat. Time to head home and get some sleep. Fast travel locations now marked on the map. Sweet. Hold X fast. Hold X appears in the apartment to fast travel. The guy's just like, ha. 
Turn out with Nero and just seeing Spyro on a fucking train. <laughs> like in Subways. So totally normal. You know. It's not every day you see your own throwing near what's better on the subway. Sanitation, this is Eddie. Yeah, hi. Uh, I'm trying to track down some items that were accidentally picked up from a dumpster outside my apartment. Dumpster number? Uh, uh, hang on. Uh, 64476. That's room 33. Truck's already left at shift. If your stuff's not there, you're out of luck. Wait, wait, please. This is important. Can you at least tell me where the truck is? Let me check. All right. Looks like it should be at the municipal garage at Bowery and Grand. Got it. Thanks, Eddie. Municipal garage. Bowery and Grand. Not a problem. So much for going home and going to else. sleep. I have to find my Spidey drive. Can't be that hard. Finding a tiny flash drive in a 30-ton garbage truck. I have years of research on that drive. Everything I've worked on since high school. So you mean you don't care about your photos or your bed or anything? You just care about the flash drive itself? That's nice to know, Peter. It's locked. Can't have people stealing garbage. Maybe there's another way in. Throw everything in sight because I'm so angry. Rawr. There we go. It's not really breaking and entering if I don't break anything, right? Okay, don't need to panic. Maybe they haven't dumped the trash yet. Nada. Ugh. Okay, time to panic. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Sorry, is there any chance the truck wasn't at the garage? Sure, I guess. Just means it'd be somewhere in West Chinatown. Great. I'm headed there now. Love how this guy is not suspicious at all that someone's trying to steal his own garbage. Hey, it's a long shot, but sometimes the guys stop for pizza before they drop off. Really? I'll check out the pizza shops. Any idea which one? One of the mom and pop joints, I think. Jerry's? No, that's uptown. I mean, original Jerry's. Oh, right. No, started with an L, I think. Larry's? That's on the east side. Uh, Leo's. Leo's, yeah. That might be it. Of course it's Leo's. I love Leo's. I'll pick you up a pie. I owe you one. 
No worries. Hope you find what you're looking for. Thanks, Eddie. Over here. I was gonna guess Leo. It's like, of course it's Leo's. Should be some trucks close by. There is. Nope, stuff's not here. Damn it. There has to be another truck around here. No sign of my stuff. <laughs> what an interesting smell. Eddie, you're my only hope. Not there either, huh? You sure they were around here? Well, the guys might have switched routes due to the upcoming Osborne rally. If your pickup was on Route 35, they'd be dropping off at the incinerator right now. Incinerator? Over by the Oh, bridge. shit. Better hustle. I love how the guy's not getting annoyed by Peter constantly calling him over and over again, too. It's kind of funny. He's like, oh, hey, I'm happy to help anybody. I mean, yeah, it's the middle of the night, but I'm happy to help you, buddy. There's the incinerator. Hope I'm not too late. Uh-oh, looks like trouble. Well then. Thanks, Spider-Man. You okay? Yeah, thanks. This gang's been terrorizing the whole neighborhood the last couple of days. There's probably more of them on the way. I'll keep an eye out. Hey, mind if I look around for some, uh, some personal items? Sure, have at it. I gotta go file an incident report. There's something there. Gotta move these bags out of the way. I think that's it. Yeah. Uh. Please be here, please be here. Yes. Got it. Hope it still works. Phew, looks like everything's here. Hey, look, an old gadget prototype. Looks kind of awesome. Why didn't I ever finish it? I think I can make this work. Now craft the web bomb. Hmm. I need two more challenge tokens. I need a laser component for the trip mine. And then those. Got it. Look. Is that guy is he spider? Uh oh. Ice him. Might as well use these to my advantage. Okay, well this night isn't quite going as planned. Where am I gonna sleep? I could try MJ's. Don't tell me you're gonna sleep with MJ. How about you just go to feast? All right. How am I gonna talk my way onto MJ's couch? <laughs> Let's 
see. Uh, hi, MJ. It's Peter. Any chance I could stay over to... Oh, that's too cool. Uh. MJ! I was just in the neighborhood and... Oh, that's insane. Uh. Hey, MJ. Now that we're talking again, I thought maybe... Oh, yeah, that just sounds pathetic. <laughs> I keep doing that. Oops. I want to look at the backpacks that I can collect over here. Why am I making this such a big deal? We're just friends, right? Friends crash on each other's couches all the time. It's not weird or anything. It's just a couch. MJ's couch. Oh, what am I thinking? I'm not leaving anything. I don't know what you're talking about, game. I need it. got a web alert. Huh. Looks like MJ's story just got published. I think I'll find somewhere else to stay. She's probably busy with work. I wish Harry was in town. I could crash with him. Hmm. Someone left me a voicemail. Numbers blocked, though. Hey there, spider. Long time no see. Miss me? Come to this address. Catch me if you can. Uh -oh. oh, boy. I think I know that voice. Damn, look at all the stuff that just opened up. that I have to correct. I'm not full of anger. I'm full of love. 
I call out injustice, corruption, and crimes against humanity because I adore this city. And I want it to be better. What you hear in my voice is love. Nothing but love. There is an assault in progress. Nearby officers, please proceed to the West Village. Classic web shooter. Hey, my Mark I web shooters. Managed to improve the storage capacity a lot since then, but the basic design's still the same. Spider plushie! Oh, a toy designer made this prototype to get me to license my likeness. Too bad there's no way to get paid without revealing my identity. A menu from my first real date with MJ. Wish I could have afforded someplace fancier. But she didn't seem to mind. I thought web swinging would let me get pizzas delivered fast. And it did. Fast and smashed. My underarm webs. I thought they might help me glide short distances, but they never really worked. Captain Watanabe gave me her cell number when she finally decided to trust me. She's risking a lot. If any Captain Watanabe gave me her cell number when she finally decided to trust me. She's risking a lot. If anyone finds out she's helping me, she'll lose her job. Fisk beat the hell out of me with these. I almost used them for evidence. Until MJ pointed out I was trespassing, so I'd probably end up in jail. Typical Parker luck. I could never give this prototype spider tracer enough range to be useful. But I did adapt the tech into my web traps, which really come in handy. Maybe this will help me balance work and a personal life, if I ever find time to read it. Almost forgot I bought this snow globe for Aunt May. I think I get my love for this city from her. Oh, oh man, I meant to wash this gym shirt six years ago. Hey, you. I beat this wrestler right after getting my powers. Never had that much money before in my life. Or since, come to think of it. This piece of the Shocker's original uniform showed me how to protect myself from his blasts. Of course, they always upgrade, don't they? Never finished this application for the coffee bean. Would have paid more than what I'm doing now. My thesis paper on neurotechnology. This got me the job with Dr. Octavius. When the vulture cracked my eye lens, it almost blinded me. That was a wake-up call. Had to upgrade to a stronger material. The jammer I whipped up to jam vulture's wings. Too bad he improved them after that. With this vial of the lizard's blood, I was able to mix up a cure and turn him back into Dr. Connors. Too bad it didn't last. My Wilson Fisk Science Prize trophy. And check. I couldn't turn it down without arousing suspicion, but no way was I gonna take his money. Even though we could have used it. I did accept the lifetime supply of backpacks, though. Hey! My prom boot in here. Crushed when I had to fight Fisk. I could... My prom boot in here. Crushed when I had to fight Fisk. It kind of symbolizes my luck with relationships. <laughs> Funny, 
My fear of heights didn't go away when I got my powers. Had to climb to the top of the Empire State to get over that. An Oscorp visitor badge from when I interviewed there. Would have paid well, but Dr. Octavius offered the chance to really make a difference. All right. Demons are getting bolder. Engaging police in the streets now. Real talk, guys. The destroy New York stick is getting old. Demons are down. I'll let you take it from here, officers. Officers needed in Tenderloin. Please copy. All right. 